Oh, oh my, what the fuck? Are they, oh my gosh, she's opening him up. Pause. Yo, what's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Mari. We are going to be watching Annihilation today. Now, this is actually recommended to one of y'all on Patreon. Appreciate you. You know who you are. This is a sci-fi horror movie. Something that I've been wanting to check out for a long time. Never got around to it. And it was recommended to me, so that's even better. Yeah, this is actually starring Natalie Portman, man. Now, I have not seen Natalie Portman in no other movie aside from, like, The Avengers, Thor, and uh, what other movie was she in? Uh, I don't even know. i just been seeing her in superhero movies, so it's going to be interesting to see her in a different, you know, environment, you know, a different theme, you know, genre of movie than what I typically see her in. So, I feel like you can't go wrong with Natalie Portman, man. It's Natalie Portman. Seeing her, you know, versatility, see how good she is as an actress. I don't know much about this movie really at all. I don't really dig too deep. I like to go into these movies blind. So we're going to watch this, get into it, waste no more time. If you want to see the full length reaction, that'd be on Patreon, along with a lot of other cool stuff on Patreon. You know, join the Patreon for free. I will be dropping a lot of free content on there, but that's enough. We ain't here for that. We're here for Annihilation and Natalie Portman. Yo, it's been a minute since I've seen any type of like alien movie, sci-fi. Well, not sci-fi, but like alien movies specifically. Um, the last alien, I lied, I lied. I watched Nope with my family. <laughs> I lied, my fault. In a random room. She getting interrogated? What did you eat? You had rations for two weeks. You're inside for nearly four months. Inside where? How long did you think you were inside? What? Days. Maybe weeks. Nah, it's gotta be scary. What happened to Josie Radak? Not remembering anything from whatever she came out of. Wherever. Is he dead? I don't know. What about Shepard? Thorson? Dead. Fetras? I don't know. Dang. Then what do you know? That's a good question. Asking her all these specific questions. Ask her what she does know. I wonder what happened though. Like, this is obviously, I'm assuming, like a. I was about to say, a fla not a flashback, but something that happened later in the movie. Was that an asteroid that was coming? Or like a meteor? Ooh, it is. That just caught me by surprise. I was not expecting that. Loki kind of jump scared me. Chilled. It's not this type of movie. Why is this guitar giving me like Last of Us vibes? Yo, why does it look like that? Yo, that's crazy. Annihilation. Wow. It looked like so like like the the color. It was like I don't know. It looked it looked crazy, like magic or something. Like all cells, it is born from an existing cell. Was well, she a she? What she talked? She sounded like is she a college professor. Born from one cell. She's teaching a class right now. A single organism, alone on planet Earth, perhaps alone in the universe. About four billion years ago, one became two. Two. Yo, science is so crazy. It was really cool, though. The rhythm of the dividing pair, which becomes the structure of every microbe, blade of grass, sea creature, land creature, <laughs> and human. The structure of everything that lives and everything that dies. Yo, when you really think about it, bro, life is so crazy. The next term, we will be closely examining cancer cells in vitro and discussing autophagic. Oh, nice. Trying to find a cure for cancer? Study it a lot more? Y'all know they already got a cure for cancer. They bullshit. Oh, wasn't he in a... He was in Planet of the Edge, right? Lena, that's her name. Dan. I've been looking for you at lunch, but you never seem to be around. I've been catching up on some writing. I'll work or no play, it's... Uh... Not healthy. Gotta, you know, loosen up a little bit, you know, get out the house. Do you have plans? Out the college, I should say. Sarah and I have a few people over. A garden party while the weather holds. Actually, I do have plans. No, you don't. It'll be a lot of fun. Thanks, Dan. I really appreciate it, but I'm going to paint our bedroom. The bedroom. Why she started on an hour? Who was supposed to be included in that hour? You're allowed to come to a barbecue. It is not a betrayal or an insult to his memory. Mm, her husband or something? I'm gonna paint the bedroom. Hey, he was just trying to be nice, you know. He was low-key trying to holler, though. He ain't slick. Yo, is that just, is it just me? But, like, I can't stop thinking of The Last of Us. I know The Last of Us ain't create, you know, guitars, but, like. Hey, oh, it is her husband, huh? I've seen the pictures on the wall. Yeah. Oh, that's, uh, uh, 
Oscar Isaac, what a goat. One of my favorite actors, man. Oh, did he die? Oh, he's in the army. He must have died serving. Damn. Come on, y'all not trying to make me cry this early in the movie. It's too early. I don't even know these characters like that. Nah, but that is crazy. I wonder what happened. Maybe was he involved in one of the people that the scientist dude was talking to her about in the beginning? When they were uh, interrogating her? What did uh, the black dude say? He said he, a year? About a year or something like that? Who the hell is this? How did you get in my house, sir? <laughs> Where did you come from? Is that him? No, that's literally him if I'm, if I'm not tripping. They're giving us the impression that he's supposed to be dead and he just pops up in the house like this? Unless she thought he was dead and he was just gone for so long and he came back. That's gotta be it, because it's not like... I doubt he just came back to life. He doesn't look good, bro. He looks... Petrified, like, he he done seen something. Boy, drink you some water. Who knows how long it's been since you had anything. Talk to us, talk to us. No one knew anything about your unit. I contacted everyone. Everyone I could. The other partners knew just as little as me. Why? Unit, I'm assuming she means like his team, the people he were with, he was with. Was it covert? Hmm. Maybe. What's that mean, maybe? Covert? Yeah, I think so. Pakistan again? I, I don't know where it was. Or... Well, it has, obviously it has something to do with what, when the asteroid hit Earth. That one uh, light lighthouse. How long have you been back? That's a great question. Know. How'd you get back? What, what base did you fly into? I don't know. What about the rest of your unit? Did they come back with you? Yo, she sounded a lot, or he sounded a lot like how she was in the interview. Didn't know anything. Face of the earth for 12 months. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. No explanation, no explanation. Does it matter? Yeah, like what's going on? Doesn't matter. I don't know who this man is, but that, that is not your husband. <laughs> That is not the same man you once knew. I'm so sad. Outside the house. No. I, outside where no, then? Outside the room. The room? What is he talking about? Was he in like some room alternate bed. dimension or something like that? On some inter interstellar shit? Looking through the bookshelf? I saw you. What? I recognized you. Yeah, that meteor put some in the atmosphere that's making people go crazy or something, see stuff or. Maybe they are seeing what they are actually, you know, uh, what he is actually speaking of. I don't feel very well. We can tell. It, it, it looks like it. Ooh, what? Stay with me, baby. Yeah, I just got goosebumps. What the hell was that? 31 hemorrhage in seizure. Stay with me, baby. Also, oh, is this? Oh, this is just now. What? What happened? Are they the? Is this the CIA, FBI? Government? What? Bro, do you have to point that gun? Like, is that really necessary? That's such a scary sight. Ooh. What? For what reason? What is the purpose, though? Like, y'all can't use y'all's words. Y'all got a mouth just like me. Is it gonna be good? Area X. He might be up to speed now. It looks like the place that she was in when, in the beginning. Why they got her in like a jumpsuit, bro? Like she's in prison. Like what did she do? Who is this? My fault if I'm asking a lot of questions, y'all. It's just me thinking out loud. Hello, ma'am. Can you tell me something, please? <laughs> you must be feeling dreadful. It's a hangover. I'm excited that you were given. Want to sit down? Why was I giving it though? Like, I'm pretty sure y'all could have just. <laughs> like, she couldn't stop y'all anyways if y'all just took her without. Maybe they, you know, it's a secret location. They don't want her knowing where it's at. Like, who's she gonna tell though? Like, come on now. Be doing way too much. My like, Dr. Ventress. <laughs> Dr. Ventress. I'm a psychologist. Okay. I've been talking to a psychologist. Am I in a psychiatric hospital? No. Seems like what? it. Where am I? Where's my husband? You served in the military for seven years. Is she? I'm a professor from Johns Hopkins. I want to know what the fuck I'm doing here. So did she or did she not serve in the military? I'd like to talk about Sergeant Kane. When did he arrive back home? Sergeant Kane. Oh, that's obviously her husband. I want to see a lawyer. You're not going to be able to see a lawyer. 
any lawyer that you would want probably is with them, so <laughs> might as well just start talking. Back. I tried to get it out of him, but... Did he contact you at any point while he was away? What did he tell you about his mission when he returned? Nothing he could remember. Did he ever mention where he was going? That's a good question, though. He never said, I never asked. But you made regular requests for information from his unit, CL, until six months ago, and then you stopped. Of course, they got all that on file. It's not easy to move on. And it? Maybe that's why she rejected the offer of the one dude, her coworker. He was extremely ill. In what way? Multiple organ failure. Mm. Massive internal bleeding. Ah. Uh, he must have been exposed to some sort of radiation. It's that me that some meteor kind of virus. It put some in the atmosphere. I could actually help him. In what way, though? I mean, she is a doctor, or I don't know what specifically, but doctor of some sort. She be studying cancer cells and shit, so you know, she gotta be able to help with something. Maybe that's why they brought her here. To help out with whatever the hell is going on with, you know, the atmosphere and what's in the air and that meteor that, that dropped. Because that wasn't just no regular meteor that came from, <laughs> from space. That looked different. It had some, like, aura around it that looked... Whoa! That's what I'm talking about. Right there, some purplish, like, weird stuff. It's like a whole cloud over it. So is it just contaminating that one area? It started around three years ago. Blackwater National Park reported that... Oh, so it started that long ago? That was three years ago when that happened? One of the wardens went in to investigate. Never returned. The event was classified. Since then, we were approached by land, by sea, sent in drones, animals. And that's what happens to all those soldiers. But nothing comes back. Not. And the boundary is getting bigger. It's expanding. Hell no. So far, it's eating into barely populated swampland, which... Say, so, okay, I was right. They did bring her here for that reason. But why didn't they just tell her that? In a few months, the area will have grown to where we are right now. So how fast is it spreading? How much time do y'all have? He's dying. Oh, that gotta be scary. Something that's just we unknown. We to an agreement about what to do with you. You're not going to let me go home. How can they? You're obviously super smart. They need you. Is that what you want? To go home? I mean, yeah, you're just gonna go home worrying about when that shit is gonna spread. No. I wanna be with him. Wow, bro. That looks cool, but like... <laughs> if you're in that situation, that shit is scary. Ain't nothing cool about that. I'm gonna take a cell. Circumvent the hay limit. Could prevent senescence. I was about to make the exact same point. It means the cell doesn't grow old, it becomes immortal, keeps dividing, doesn't die. That's kind of crazy when you think about it. It's actually a fault in our genes. Interesting. You get really turned on when you patronize me. <laughs> you didn't tell me where you're heading this time. Yeah, obviously this is before. I know there's something strange about this mission. She knew something was off. Why? I wonder if he knew. The silence around it is louder than usual. Like, you know how crazy it'd be if, like, they didn't tell, like, the soldiers where they were heading into? I'm sure they knew, because, like, something that you can't really, like, hide. Like, they're going to get there, so you might as well prepare them for what's to come. So this was 12 months ago. I wonder how long, like, because obviously a whole year passed since she's seen him. But how long was he just, like, good to the point where he wasn't good, if that makes sense? Damn. The amount of stress that just hits you in a moment like this gotta be crazy. I'm guessing you probably feel weird or awkward. Somewhat, I guess. I mean, y'all seem a little too comfortable, you know? Too content. How long y'all been here? The people here put themselves to sleep in fetal position, making cooing noises. It's freaky. <laughs> I'm Anya. Lena. Anya, okay. You all been here a long time? Uh, I'm yeah, I'm wondering the same right thing. from the start. I'm a DMR. Right from the start. So they've been here three years since it was found. Uh, and I've been here ten months. Ah, ten months. Paramedic from Chicago. I tried to join an NGO. My application got flagged, so Southern Reach got me. Wow. Only two months. Did they capture y'all the same way or <laughs> did y'all come here willingly? <laughs> what? You know, we had a better near profession than Josie had biologist, of course. <laughs> 
I have law enforcement. No, that's funny. Single. Jesus. Do you have to hit on everyone, like, all the time? Come on, fuck that. Under the circumstances, I think I'm allowed to roll the dice. Facts. No, no, no. I agree. I'm with her. Under what circumstances? What do you mean, what circumstances? Well, yeah. I'm mean, obviously um, don't know the full crazy details, as but... It seems crazy as it is. Yeah, not seems, like... We are headed that way. I figured, you know, why else would y'all be here? Y'all not gonna be studying from going afar. Y'all gonna Six get nowhere doing that. Counting. Six days. Wow. You three? Four. No, that's kind of crazy though, bro. They had all this time to prepare and they got Lena a week prior before they go into the storm? Like, nah, that's messed up. <laughs> Hell no, bro. Previous teams have been largely military, so, yeah. Hmm. Stupid men. Just say it, man. Like, come on now. Damn, they really got it. How are they even gonna like, like, what precautions do you take for a situation like this? And how do you prepare to even go into a storm like that? And what tools do you bring? Because like, you don't even know what the atmosphere is like. You don't know what is like at all in there. Anything, any details, nothing. So it's like, that's got to be crazy. I know why you went in. Why? Tell me, please. Did he have a choice though? That's the real question. I'm so sorry. I mean, he's right for doing so. I, do. I mean, what's going to make them different than other people? I thought it would complicate things. That went in before. What? What would it complicate? Why are you going into the Shimmer? The mission statement is to reach the supposed source of the Shimmer, the lighthouse, enter, acquire data. And then what? It's your mission statement. No. Just hearing the storm in the background, that's so scary. I pick the teams. They enter. So I'm assuming Amy and them did volunteer and willingly, willingly come here. I'm sitting here wondering why they brought her Lena here forcefully, but it's probably because like her husband you know, is the one that survived. You need to know what's inside. I guess, but and everybody that's come out was either crazy and didn't remember or so died. I. So that's the complication. You want to come with us? I oh, can't so they do anything for him here. So their intentions weren't to put her in there. What were they gonna have her do then? You can learn. You can save him. Can you blame her for trying. Now it kind of the speed that is fire. Mission. I love a movie do stuff like that. All other missions had failed, and the only survivor was barely surviving. Hmm. The brave choice. I owed him. I'm only trying to understand what drove you. Science. I owed him. So I went in. I mean, what other motive does she need than for him, you know? Oh, that's her husband. Didn't see that man for a whole year. Didn't hear from him at all either. Oh, just like that. It's been six days. They strapped though. Got to. But did they just walk in or like, how do they, how do they know it's not going <laughs> to, well, never mind. I was going to say, how do they know if it's not going to just obliterate them as soon as they step through? But they would have known that from the first people that they put through. Oh, fire. She did say she was going going in. I didn't know if she was for real or not. Because, you know, most people that are head of anything, they just be sitting back, observing, throw other people in there, in the fire to burn. Feminism at its finest. Love to see it. Damn, just like that, okay. I wonder if it feels like anything, like, walking through, like, just, you know, the shimmer, okay? Is that what they, they called it? Oh, that's a crazy cut from what we were just looking at. <laughs> it was obviously her husband or something. Before. What? Wait, was this before? Wait, 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 what was going on? Huh? Yo, these random, these cuts is so crazy. Like, what, what is going on? Was she a mat? Was she? Was she having a wet dream <laughs> about that man? <laughs> Got a whole husband, and you dreaming about another man? Mm -mm. She gonna blame it on the storm when she get out? <laughs> I swear, it was you know the atmosphere, you know, it was affecting my brain cells and. Nah, I just wasn't thinking straight. <laughs> oh, nah. But why was she dreaming of that? Unless it wasn't a dream. It was a night that happened and she was reminiscing. Interesting. Oh, you're finally awake. Hey, give me a second. I I'm a little disoriented. Join the club. You don't remember setting up camp, do you? Hmm, they don't remember? Okay, that's scary. Something that early on? It's the tree behind me. None of us do. And we did a food inventory? The effects are that fast? Now here for at least three or four days. 
What? Okay, that's crazy. Compass not working. So Messing up the magnetic field. No compass, no comms, no coordinates. No sense of direction at all. And no landmarks. Whoa. That's crazy. Don't even got a compass to use. Hit the ocean, then we can just follow the shoreline until we hit the perimeter wall, right? How do we know it's south? Come on, Josie, you know this. Our hand Let me know. the sun. Okay. So what the difference between the hour hand and 12? South. Good. We're oriented. We weren't really expecting the comms equipment to work, were we? I mean, it's been three years of expeditions and three years of radio silence. Damn. Let's pack up and get moving. So her husband was probably going through the same thing. It was probably way longer for him then. Because it was a year that he was gone. But for them that were, you know, in this same, you know, situation, in the same, you know, the, the shimmer, it was probably like a cool few years for them. Felt like probably. That's crazy. Shouldn't they have brought like a few army men with them or no? Are they insinuating that men are weak minded? Hmm. Looks like someone's about to have a wedding. Oh, that's actually sad. But they're growing from the same branch structure. So it has to be the same species. It's the same plant. It's all together? It's like that's crazy. Stuck in a continuous mutation. A pathology? Must have happened due to whatever's in the air that's affecting y'all's sense of time and just everything. I don't know if I want to go across the water though. <laughs> I don't even know what's in one? here. No, there is anything in here. It's been long abandoned, maybe even before. Ooh! Oh my gosh, quit playing. No, no, no. She's playing, right? No, she's playing, right? Please tell me she's playing. Oh, she's not playing. Oh, hell no. What happened? What just grabbed her? No, that dead ass just scared the mess out of me. Bro, pull her up. Oh, that's what I'm telling you. Do not go across the water. We do not know what's down there. And it's dirty. You can't even see through it. Stop going out. Oh, stop going out on your own. You have to move with the group. That. Get up, get up. There's no way that thing grabbed her. Is that an albino alligator? That thing is huge. Hey, relax. We don't want no smoke. Just get back in the water. Oh, did, did the atmosphere, did this area, the shimmer affect like the animals too? Like make them mutate in some way? Bro, it's obviously not working. Get out the way. Yo, he is eating these bullets. Okay, looks like it's having some type of effect, a little bit. Affect them a little bit. Come on now, please. Maybe. Y'all saw inside the mouth, it looked a little different. Like he had like teeth around like the back of his throat and just inside all around. I never really investigated and looked inside alligator's mouths like that, so I don't know if that's just normal. But that ain't look normal to me. It's exactly the same as the flowers. Okay, so look I knew I wasn't teeth. tripping. I knew I wasn't tripping. Concentric rose. Something here is making giant waves in the gene pool. Yeah. Sharks have teeth like that, don't they? Do you think it's a crossbreed? That's what it looks we like. We can't crossbreed between different species. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out how the hell that alligator just grabbed her the and pulled her back that fast. At first. More extreme as we grew closer to the lighthouse. Hmm. Yeah, where it all where it started. Duplicates of form. Duplicates. Echoes. Can you elaborate? Is it possible these were hallucinations? Hell no. Nah. She saw these things. I wondered that myself. Ah, uh, well, could they be. were shared among all of us. Hmm, true. Like y'all having the same hallucinations? It was dreamlike. How? How? You know how rare is that? Nightmarish. Got to be super rare. Not always. Sometimes it was beautiful. Is she good? Oh, I feel like getting any type of cut here is like, oh, she's infected. Hell no. Oh, okay. Never mind. That for the gator. Yeah. I feel like she's lying though. Ain't no damn bruise. So, where'd you learn to shoot? It looked like it though. She was in the I was army. In the military before I was an academic. That's okay, so how she was. Why she blow it off though, as if she wasn't when she was talking to the, the one girl. Feels like a lifetime ago now. Which do you carry around her neck? A husband or a child? Husband. He was in the army too. That's that's how we met. Was in the army. He quit. KIA. KIA. Killed in action. I don't know why it took me so long to <laughs> put that together. Obviously, he Volunteering wasn't. Volunteering for this. It's not exactly something you do if your life is in. 
I was gonna say she didn't volunteer. She was brought here forcibly, and then she volunteered. So I guess technically she volunteered. Yo, look at the environment. It actually looks kind of cool Josie though. Josie wears long sleeves because she doesn't want you to see the scars in her forearms. She's mm. tried to kill herself. Oh, I think the opposite. Trying to feel alive. Uh, there's a lot, a lot of other things that you can do to feel alive, and I'm not trying to be insensitive about that topic, but no friends. No family, no partner, no children, no concession in her at all. Oh, wow. You? I also lost someone. Not a husband, though. Um, a Sibling? daughter. Sibling? Uh, Leukemia. Ah, uh, man. My beautiful girl and the person I once was. Hey, hey! A little you. Like, that's every parent. They see them and their child. I wonder why she didn't really explain that her husband is the one that was found. I mean, she ain't got to explain nothing to nobody. You know, that's her business, but everybody got stories here. So, you know, everybody lost somebody. This used to be the headquarters of the Southern Reach. Mm. Before the Shimmer swallowed it. More mutations. Yep. Like, look at that. It looks cool, though. Lignant. Like tumors. I wouldn't touch it or anything, though, if I were you. Get like a little sample or something. Proceed with caution. Don't need nobody getting swooped up by nothing. Any people are here? We're here. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the past tense. That's... I'm just waiting till I see like an alien tentacle creature with like four eyes. <laughs> oh. It's a nice little place to, you know, set up camp though. Shit is heavy. Ominous music be making me Careless. nervous. Bro, can y'all please stop going places alone? Travel in pairs at least. Okay, my fault. You're just looking at something. Oh, I'm so paranoid. <laughs> Mayor. Oh, they were writing down the time? Kane. All the people that they were interrogating you about. It was on the last expedition. Looks like they were using this room as their base of operations. Why are some of the names crossed out? Let's not jump to conclusions. I don't know, maybe we should. Yeah. Why wouldn't you? Like in this situation, you gotta expect the worst. I think that the times by the names are guard rota, so they were guarding the perimeter, we should too. Ooh. See, I was about to say, ah. I, mean, I guess it's better than the little place that they were at before when they first got here. It's like, damn, it's only, what, five of y'all? I gotta protect this whole perimeter? This might be able to tell us something. Name tags? For those that follow. No. I believe that means us. Uh, left a note. That's smart. Communicate with anybody else who comes, you know, in contact with this place and even makes it here. Memory card. Oh. Should be able to play this. Fire. Oh my gosh, that's so genius. Did they come across the alligator too? I hear some water. Okay. Okay. There you go. Ooh. Are oh, they finna stab him? Okay. Wait, wait, what's going on? Does he have something inside him? Like, ah. Or does it not affect him when they're here? No, it definitely affects him. Look at him. What is he doing? Yeah, for real. What is the purpose? Are they, oh my gosh, he's opening him up. Pause. He's still good though. Oh! Oh my gosh. That is disgusting. What? His whole insides are just like look tentacles. What is inside him? Why is he smiling? That is disgusting. There was something alive inside that man. No, that's what that I'm was saying. Trick of the light. What? I've been a paramedic for ten years. Trick of the light? Nah, don't pull that bullshit on me. We all saw that. <laughs> It was shock. Reddick, that was a shock response. Watch it again. No, I'm not gonna fucking watch it again. You know what you saw. That's why you're acting like this. It was literally like a tentacle wrapped around his entire, like, insides. Y'all not tell me they put that shit in CapCut and started editing and making effects, bro. Like, that is real. Y'all saw what y'all saw. And the fact that he was still good, though, when he, when they cut him open. Yo, the way this place works is actually insane. Like, there's no way he should have been alive after that. How did that thing even get inside him? I was saying earlier, I was expecting to see a tentacle monster. Well, there it is. Oh, what the heck? Another one of these, like, plant, like, wall spreads. I don't know what this thing is. Not even plant. It's, like, 
whole bunch of like I don't even know. Oh, is this the dude that they cut open? And then it just like starts spreading out. Oh my gosh! What is it? I don't know. I knew that was his skull. Yo, this is crazy. That's the knife. I knew it was the dude that they gutted out. Stay here tonight. We don't have a choice. Y'all don't really. Like, where else y'all gonna go? Please. I feel like y'all losing daylight Come soon on. too. It's too late in the day for us to move on. Yep. Come on, let's go outside. I feel like I'm gonna be making this face this whole <laughs> this whole movie. Oh my gosh, bro. Wow. I'm sleeping up there. Keep me up there. <laughs> So the birthday meet tape back at the house back a year before all of this. That's nice of you. Yo, them going back and forth between different, you know, times is <laughs> throwing me off. Oh, this is when you look like to leave, huh? I gotta leave a day early. Hmm. Wait, today? Right now. Oh, shit. But we had a whole day plan. We were gonna yeah, drive to the we country. Can. We can't. Can you at least? One more time. Nah, I that means right now. I'm just now realizing he came back exactly the way he looks right now. Love you, Lena. Oh, he was talking like he knew he wasn't gonna come back. But y'all feel me though? He looked the exact same as he did when he came back. That's crazy. What are these little microorganisms I'm looking at? Is that her arm? Or what is she looking at? No. Mystery unraveling. <laughs> Something's unraveling. I think you're doing okay. Look at Josie's getting some rest. Yeah. The help of a little sedative. How about you? Gets me sleep. Some. Basically, not at all. Because this Josie. I'm just hiding it better. Actually, just checking outside, like, bro. Why does she look down there like she don't know? Okay, no, she's down there. I'm like, <laughs> Yo, they got me stressed. Are you out here you like this by yourself? Supposed to relieve me until three. I'm done sleeping for the night. Come look at this. Okay, this is where we are, and that's the lighthouse. Southwest is Vale Perdue. It's a small community we evacuated two years ago. I think we should head there tomorrow, and then head out for the coast the following morning. Yo, it's crazy now. I wonder what's gonna happen when they get to the lighthouse. You didn't tell the team about your connection to Kane. I wasn't sure if that was a good idea. Me too. I'm like, I wouldn't necessarily say good idea. Not a good idea, but. I'm not sure how they would have reacted to you. Yeah. Considering he did just like cut him open. Might but I'm like. Volunteer for a suicide mission. Is that what you think we're doing? Committing suicide. You must have profiled him. You must have assessed him. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but it's like, come on, be for real. So you're asking me as a psychologist. I mean, that is your profession. Then as a psychologist, I'd say you're confusing suicide with self-destruction. Almost none of us commit suicide, and almost all of us self-destruct. In some way... Explain the difference. We drink, or we smoke. Okay, we never mind, my fault. We the good job. That makes a lot of sense. The happy marriage. These aren't decisions, they're... They're impulses. In fact, probably better equipped to explain this than I am. What does that mean? You're a biologist. Isn't self-destruction coded into us? Programmed into each cell? Well, I guess in some way. <laughs> See, y'all outside, man. Y'all need to... I don't even know if being up in the watchtower will be a good idea. Ooh, I'm just waiting for something to pop out. Something's gonna start rushing towards y'all like a demogorgon, just full speed. Through the fence? It's ripped open like a Zipper. Oh. I can't see anything. Oh my gosh. Oh, was that a bear? Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe like there's no like actual aliens. It's just about like maybe like how this meteor affected the animals and they're mutating them in a way that makes them alien, I guess. No, because we definitely just saw some tentacles in that dude's body. I'm tripping. Never mind. Forget everything I just said. Oh my gosh, I just realized she got took. Wait, who the who who'd it take? Oh no, bro. Oh no. Oh my gosh, bro. And they don't even know where it went. This lit is low-key like kinda like 
uh, similar in a way, I guess, to like how like the world deconstructed kind of to like, you know, The Last of Us and like the apocalyptic vibe that this gives. Because if this spreads to the entire world, it would be apocalyptic for sure. We have to go back. And the guitar, of course. Now. She's right. Right? In what sense? We've been attacked twice. Go back and leave her? We have evidence. Y'all don't even know if she's if she's gone. Mother Rob, I, I really don't know how much more right she has to be. We haven't reached the lighthouse. We still don't understand the cause or the nature of the shimmer. We have data, observations, photographs. She has hella footage. All of which makes the phenomenon less explicable, not more. I'm gonna get to the lighthouse. She has a point. I'm fine going on my own. You just you, need to decide. You literally cannot let her go alone. Oh my gosh, bro. And this is what happens. Y'all cannot split up. Y'all can't. It's a crazy old bitch. You know, and thanks for the fucking backup, Lena. <laughs> What'd she say fuck me for? <laughs> yeah, there are sides. Okay. And I agree with you. We should go back. Good. Okay, great. There we go. Okay, so the three of us can just Hold on. Like, Hold on. We should go back. Yes, but it took us, what, six days to get here? And the coast is two days away. Mm. Shepard said. More logical. Y'all might as well, bro. Y'all are just working backwards at this point if y'all don't. we get out by going deeper in? Yeah, if you like, yeah. Like? No, I don't fucking like. Well, by all means, go on your own. Like, go back home yourself. This isn't some bullshit tactic to get us to the lighthouse, is it? This is not about the lighthouse. I believe that the coast is the best route. Oh, no, nah, I feel like they're going to really piss if they find out that that's her husband. Because she really can't say no to her. Like, y'all don't have any other options, bro. I love this. I love how they're switching back between interrogation and then you know what she experienced so far great storytelling i didn't know what going back meant why it would be safer than going forward you didn't know but you made the decision to continue as if you did ventures mm. made the decision ventures had cancer she was never coming back you knew what? she was sick i guessed wow and you wanted to continue that's why she's just going in yes I did. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah, I don't know what that is on like the branches and the trees and stuff and on the walls that we've been seeing so far, but I don't know, it just looks so colorful and like I don't know, the aesthetic is just cool. What is that? She could still be alive. Oh it's highly her shoe. doubtful. Highly doubtful. We need to know. Come on, bro. If I don't see a body, they're not dead. Go. Fine. I'm coming with you. Go alone. Oh my gosh, why do they always do this? Go with her. I don't give a damn what she's talking about. Some of them, I'll go alone. Gosh, it's the whole. This is <laughs> this is exactly how old girl got got caught because she went alone. To be fair, that thing did come in really fast, so it's like it's not her fault entirely. But <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like I made everything albino. That thing looks so magical and just, just enchanting. Yo, that's kind of cool. And the little, the, the flowers on its like antlers. Yo, that is fire. The way they move is kind of nasty though. I love when movies do that too, where you just hear nothing but the environment. Footsteps of the person walking. That's also super scary. Don't tell me she found a body. Oh my gosh. She's still good, right? She's not good. What am I talking about? It looked like a bear that took her up. So, look at the roots falling to the ground. Oh, it's not even... Oh, no, that is. I thought that was somebody else. I don't know who else it would be. Oh my gosh, bro. Fuck. I mean, at least we have confirmation now. Instead of just guessing that she's dead. She's dead. I hate the way that she just picked up that bag like that. Like, I told you so. She didn't listen to me. Like, we gotta check first. You okay? Fine. Well, can y'all stop asking that? Y'all know y'all are all alone. losing y'all's mind. My fault? Look at this. The last of Us. This. I know Last of Us isn't the only like apocalyptic type movie, you know. But I don't know, it's just the guitar, you know, matched up with the, you know, the environment with the, you know, the moss and trees and leaves, you know, going over all the buildings and ground. 
this looks so cool though. Something about just this vibe that looks so cool. I want to ask this. Ooh, what? I don't know why that kind of spooked me. That's a little kid holding his parents' hand, our older brother's sibling. How did this even happen, though? They've grown like this the, That's what I'm saying. Like, a tree just, like, formed no into, like, human-like. Our humans were standing there in that place, and it grew over them, and their body decayed or something like that. At first, I thought the radio waves were blocked by the shimmer, and that's why no one inside could communicate with base or GPS, Talk to me. but... The light waves aren't blocked, they're refracted and... Refracted. It's the same with the radios. The signals aren't gone. Okay. They're scrambled. Scrambled. So how do you get them together? That leaf in your hand. Do you know what you get if you sequenced it? What? Human Hox genes. Hox? What does is, Hox is mean? They're the genes that define the body plan, the physical structure. Oh. And the plants have human body plan arms. Wow. Legs to hips. It's literally not possible. It's literally we're looking at it. We're, we're literally looking at it. Not just light and radio waves. Animal DNA. Plant DNA. All DNA. What do you mean all DNA? She's talking about our DNA. She's talking about us. Wow. This is her house. And this is what he meant by saying, I was here outside the room in the beginning. Wow. That's crazy. Listen, unless I'm tripping, but this is her house. I'm pretty sure those are the stairs that he walked up. All right. I guess this is a bedroom. Let's secure doors and windows. This is better than that big ass like open warehouse they were in. You're infected. Don't hide it from the group. I literally that's one of my mm, that's one of my pet peeves in, in, in these types of movies. Hiding infections and stuff like that. Like, come on now. You gotta say something. He playing the same like guitar like solo, the same guitar. Was she looking at her blood cells? I knew something was wrong with her arm, unless I'm tripping. Something is going on within, inside them. It's like, same way she was explaining the plants. Well, it's the same things happen, happening to her? What is going on? Like, what are we doing right now? <laughs> Talk to me, Lena. Oh, this must have been, now that I'm thinking about it, this must have been after he had left. Or the day that he did leave. And that keeps replaying in her head because her husband's about to die and she maybe feels guilty for it. Yep. Okay. You spent more time away from your husband than with him. You can't talk to him about work and he won't talk to you about his. And there is a clear physical and intellectual connection between us. Have I covered the bases? You forgot to mention your wife. I love my wife. <laughs> Cap. She's blameless in this. Why is he talking so nonchalantly as if, like, he didn't just do what he just did? I'm trying to be her therapist and shit, oh, like, man. you're in the wrong too, buddy. What's really going on here? You're no better. You think that something may have happened to him? She knows. You think somehow he's found out about our affair? I feel like that's the least of her worries, to be honest. Us? Yes. Oh. We should go. No, Lena, I got Dan. About our affairs. Why? I'm not interested in talking. Why is he denying it? Like, just get dressed and get out. You know, it's not me you hate. It's yourself. Okay, bro. You're not gonna do this, bro. You're not gonna do this. No, Dan. It's you too. Like, what? You're not gonna come to my house, do what we just did, and sit and act like... You lying bitch! Like, I didn't know why he just did that. What's going on? No. I told you. I knew it. You don't get to I knew they was gonna get pissed. Question. You answer it! Oh my gosh, bro. They turn it against each other. She tied all of them up? Now, how'd y'all let her do that? Brother. Come on now. Boyfriend. Husband. Why didn't you tell us? <laughs> she thinks she's a supervillain, like. Did you know? 
I thought Amy was cool, so bro. So there are two theories of what went wrong in the Shimmer. One is that something in here killed them. Two is that they went crazy and they killed each other. That's exactly what's going two on with her. Two nearly got killed by an alligator and Cass did get killed by a bear. I didn't actually see a bear. And neither did Josie. Hmm. The only people who saw a bear were Lena and Ventress. So nothing's confirmed. Everything's on their word. So they're tripping. They're seeing two different things. What? Does she think... No, is that Lena is a liar. Shut the fuck up! Did you kill Cass? I knew it. I was about to say, I think she thinks that she killed her. Oh my gosh, bro. Maybe she did. She could have killed her. She don't even remember. We're just going to fuck each other up. That's theory too. Oh, and this is where it starts, bro. Don't do this. Don't do this. If I let you go and you tied me to a chair and cut me open. Oh, uh, so she's afraid my of. going to move like my fingerprint. Mm -hmm. She thinks that whatever she saw is inside her. And she's probably right, unfortunately. I'm not the one tied to a chair. Oh my gosh. Oh, she finna cut her open? No way, right? She's the main character. She gotta have plot armor. <laughs> Who was that? Is somebody upstairs? Oh, yes. oh she's she's tripping. She gotta be tripping. <laughs> Oh, she's finna get got by some monster that's like mimicking her or something. I don't know, bro. Yo, this movie is crazy. Oh, hell no. Just stay quiet. Just stay quiet. Oh, my. What the fuck? Yeah, she was losing her mind, bro. Uh... That is terrifying. Hell no. It's echoing the, the screams back to her. Back to them. Now I understand where the horror genre comes into play. <laughs> I mean, we've been seeing this since, you know, they entered this place, but... She was overthinking like crazy. She was... And you can't blame her, but... Maybe what they saw in the dude's stomach wasn't really what they saw, but no, there's no way. Because we saw him splattered with everything spreading all the wall. Don't say anything. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. Come on, duck, get down. Tilt your chair over. You're gonna get hit with a bullet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Your valiant sacrifice. We we appreciate your, you know, your effort. Aww. I don't know if going to the lighthouse is a good idea, but what else can they do? Oh my gosh, this is on some Mortal Kombat type of shit, bro. The way these people are dying and the way that they look after, dismembered and all. Skull stretched, jaw broken. Nice, come on, nice. Whoa, I didn't expect this to be on some like Mortal Kombat, like I said, fatality type of gore. This is crazy. I'm leaving now. Oh, now you want to leave? It's not even night yet. I don't have time to wait. We are disintegrating our bodies as fast as our minds. Can't you feel it? Oh, uh, yeah. I it's think like she's the onset of dementia. If I don't reach the lighthouse soon, okay, that's what I was saying. I think she's still going to the lighthouse. This journey won't be the person that ends it. No facts. I want to be the one that ends it. But I feel like it's just going to get stronger the more you get closer to the source. But I feel what she's saying. Now, now I understand why her husband was so fucked up when he came back. Wow. Can somebody explain this to me again? Like the plants and like how she explained like it forming, like it having like the cells of like you know the. The, the the construct of like the body or something like that i mean it's gorgeous until you know them them bears and alligators start popping out oh i'm just not realizing that's a i can't remember her name but oh she's a good actress too i can't remember what she was in though I'm talking about the girl on the right how long was your husband in the shimmer who knows it's hard to say exactly too long theoretically as long as a year it's a long time to be inside and remain intact not so sure it was intact I checked my blood last night. Yeah, I knew that's what she was looking at. It's in me. Mm, yep. Spreading into everybody that steps foot in here slowly. That's what happened to her husband. Like they said, like, you know. It was so internal strange. bleedings Harry. and all that. Shepherd's voice in the mouth of that creature last night. 
Oh yeah, that's scary. I think as she was dying, part of her mind became part of part of the creature that was killing no, her. No, that's Imagine wow. Imagine being frightened and in pain and having that as the only part of you which survives. I just got I chills. I wouldn't like that at all. Look at her face, bro. Ah, oh. What? Is she gonna become one of the plants? Ventress wants to face it. Did you see that coming out of her arms? You don't want to fight it, but I don't think I want either of those things. Yeah, I don't. I don't blame you. I'm not gonna lie. She's always has 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 had this self-destructive mindset, like old girl is saying. Josie. Nah, it's too late. You can't save her now. Ah. Uh, she like we can't beat him. We gotta join it. Wow. Uh, Ain't no telling which one she turned into. So that's what was happening. I knew it was like, there's no way it was just like forming like that by itself. There had to have been like people. One by one, all gone, except you. Mmm, so she was the last remaining How'd you one. explain that? Is it something I need to explain? Yes, you do. I mean, yeah. Like, what? I had to come back. I'm not sure any of them did. Mmm, lighthouse. Trying to listen to the words, the lyrics. See if it has anything to do with what's going on. <laughs> this is so unsettling, bro. And obviously, yeah, because the other girl left. It was just her that she was talking to, and she turned into the old plant figure. She got to the lighthouse. What now? I, look at the water, though. Look how it's reflecting. Like, the, all the colors. That looks so cool. The trees are like... Water. Is it like ice? It looks like ice or something. Yeah, that's ice. I was right. Or some type of like crystallized like shards. That's what it looks like more so, yeah. Not not ice. Huh? This looks really cool though. That does not. Okay, here's the source. The lighthouse is glowing at the top. How does she even get back though? Like oh, I, I mean I guess we're about to find out. I'm over asking questions. Ah. Uh... Who laid it out like this? Somebody has to have laid them out like this, cause that, that doesn't just happen naturally. Ugh. You, you just can't go down there. Like, whatever you're thinking, you just you just can't go down there. And the thing is, she probably, she went back without anything, like any sort of like evidence. I mean, as far as we know, so far. What the hell happened to him? Was he recording it? Does that camera even still work? If it does, that's crazy work. Imagine showing this to the public. Oh no. Yeah, whoever's record whoever was recording this set these out like that. And it's a sick individual. Oh, and it was the husband. Of course it was. It has to be. He was the only one alive. That Oh no, because it has to have been the person that Oh, Oh no, that actually just gave me some chills. So was her husband not even alive? I was wondering, I was gonna say too, before I was like, is her husband like, not even her husband? Just something that has memories of, of her husband? But it's like actual monster, just like the bear that was gathering memories of like, the people that it was consuming? I'm like, oh, what happened to him? Did he just like implode or something? I thought I was a man, I had a life. People call me Kane, and now I'm not so sure. If I wasn't Kane, what was I? Where did this country accent come from? I promise you, you did not have this in the beginning. Then again, we didn't really hear him talk much, but... Are you me? Oh, wait, is this like... My flesh moves like liquid. My mind is just cut loose. I can't bear it. Oh, my gosh. So who was the man... I... Who was the man that came back to her? Was it something that was like... Made up of his cells or something like that, infused with whatever is in this environment. You're kind of bright. Oh, grenade! Don't please don't show us. Please don't show us. If you ever get out of here, you find Lena. Oh, I will. What? Oh no, that's creepy. What the hell? Four, three, two. Who the hell answered? I will. No, no, for real. 
It was that figure, that figure that was standing above the, uh, or in the hole that he was pointing at. Oh, no, nah, y'all. I'm not going to lie. I'm actually like, like, this is actually like terrifying. It's actually like very unsettling and uncanny. Like, this is so. Is that the one? Uh, one lady? Oh, and you're going in. Oh, my gosh. Please tell me you at least brought back the camcorder to showcase what happened. Because there's no way you just didn't bring that back. Am I tripping on Like, there was literally that, like, the figure when he was recording of a man, like, a a tall, like, figure, like, shaped man. Oh, I was right. It is her. Oh, my. Is this the meteor? Or, or, it was probably even a meteor. It could have been, like, an alien creature that they're obviously inside of it. Vanished into heaven. Do you have a, where's your flashlight? Like, unfathomable mind. Now, bacon. Now, see. Dr. Ventures? Oh, and her face is normal now? Lena. Trigger's getting pulled immediately. I'm sorry, but it's like. <laughs> what was it we said? I'm not gonna pull the trigger immediately, but I'm aiming it towards her. Then Finger on the trigger. To know what was inside the lighthouse. And now you know. What, what use does this, you know? It's inside me now. What's inside you? Them tentacle things that was inside it's that other dude. We, we've been through that. Seems like it, it just wants to consume and destroy. Until it encompasses everything. Literally, yeah. Bodies in our minds will be fragmented into their smallest parts until... Wow. Not one part remains. Annihilation. Annihilation. Wow. I literally just got teary eyed because of how cold that was. What? Oh my gosh. Is that how she got back? That doesn't make any sense though. How would that. Oh my gosh, the soundtrack, this music. Yo, the visual effects on this. This is an amazing shot. This is stunning. I I I, I don't know what to say. I'm speechless. What is that? Did it take a part of her? It got a drop of her blood. That that can't be good. I I, I I'm I'm speechless. I I don't know what's going on. We're seeing cells, some microorganisms mass producing into something. Oh, into the shape of a. Uh, oh no. Is that what it's gonna do across the whole world? What is this though? Now you wanna bring out your gun? It is the ultimate being now. <laughs> oh, I don't like this music. And you dropped your gun? I mean, I know it didn't work, but it's like, I need at least some type of, like, you know, sense of, like, you know, safety. I swear, if this thing starts chasing after, how the hell? Now, this gotta be the craziest I've ever felt watching any movie, bro. In a while, at least. Oh, hell no. Y'all, I have so many goosebumps. Y'all can't tell, but, like, I've been getting chills down my spine this entire time. Get that camera. It probably destroyed it. Oh no! Weave that shit, damn. And of course, like every other alien entity, gets rid of the footage, or makes it to the point where you can't recognize. Why does that sound sound so familiar? That uh, what is that called? That's like a, I don't know what that's called. Let me know, y'all, in the comments if y'all know. I feel like somebody sampled this in a song. This sound like some shit Travis Scott used or something. Is it like learning how to like act as her or like human? <laughs> Does it have a heartbeat? Is that what I'm hearing right now? This isn't, that isn't even her. Just like her, her husband. This thing came back as her. Unless I'm, unless I'm tripping. Why is it like, it's mimicking her, it's like, 
is mirroring her movements. I will say this is one of the most creative sci-fi horror movies I've seen. I think she realizes now. It's mirroring her. Why though? This ominous music, man. Did she do the same thing her husband did? Oh, that's smart. It's starting to form into her. Yeah, the same way it happened with the dude. With her husband. I think that's what it was doing. It was trying to, like, get enough to be able to, like, replicate her or something like that. Run! Uh, I'm not looking back. You didn't grab the camcorder. I'm like, are you serious right now? Where did it even go? It's not even in the room anymore. Maybe she didn't. No, she... Alright, she did use it as a weapon. And then like, I don't know where it landed. So that was obviously the real husband. The one that's currently hospitalized if he's not already dead. If it's not already dead. Was some alien life form. Some like, whatever this thing is spreading it for some reason i don't know what good this does the score is absolutely amazing though it's crawling back into its hole so obviously the thing is underground so it's like so i'm assuming since she burned it and it's burning all of its insides the entire thing that she successfully like defeated it which is how she was able to go back home because this area was just kind of like like it just dispersed out of out of you know the air out of the area that you know it kind of like took control over and the atmosphere kind of faded and it went back to normal that was like glitching kind of looked like a hologram that's what it looks like look at the sky like everything's like falling apart yeah look at it it's fading wow that was the most stressful and confusing and scary 10 minutes of my life that felt way too long like in a good way but like bad way at the same time so because i was terrified it. can you describe its form i mean it was human like no was no. it cotton based or? can you tell them something please i don't know i mean that's what that's it want? i don't how, think how it wanted anything it, it seemed like it just Wanted it to consume you. and destroy. It mirrored me. Yeah, I'm like, I don't know about attack. I attacked it. Exactly. I'm not sure it even knew I was there. It came here for a reason. How do you know it came here? How do you it know it didn't crash land? Our environment. It was destroying everything. It wasn't destroying. Yeah, I'm like, if anything, it, it was, was changing everything. Yeah. It was making something new. Giving it a new look, a little DIY, you know? Why weren't they recording everything? A team reached the lighthouse a few hours ago. Everything is ash. If what you encountered was once alive, it seems it's now dead. Well, that's fucking great to hear. <laughs> I mean, we knew that though. We saw it. My thing is, like, I'm sitting here asking all these questions, but maybe we're not meant to know. Maybe it's meant to be like unknown and like, you know, a mystery. Now, will you tell me what happened to my husband? You mean that thing when the that. disappeared. Blood pressure stabilized and his pulse rate started to rise. A few hours later, he was not only awake, he was lucid. Lucid. He's still in isolation, obviously. Okay, talk to me, if you can. You are okay. That's what I'm saying, I'm like, yeah, that's not him. How are you? You were just ordered, you were like, sent. So maybe. I don't think so. What do you mean? He was telling you, I'll find Lisa, you know, what did he say? I can't remember exactly what he said, like protect her or something, just find her. What is he going to do with that information? Because obviously I'm assuming it has like bits and pieces of like who Kane is. Okay, I was about to say, I'm like, that'd have been. What? That's still weird though. It's like, that's not your husband. Look at his eyes. Am I tripping? I'm not. It's, 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 it's. No, 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 no. Wait, what? 
it was like going through like the colors that it was like the, that the meteor was like that the alien thing was wow y'all wow i'm not gonna lie i want to look up a video of like explaining this movie but i'm not gonna lie just i feel like i got everything it was just like not really much that they gave us on like explaining what these what this thing was or what it really wanted it seemed like it was just kind of consuming and like changing and making you know you know like i said changes with the environment and just you know the atmosphere and just you know these creatures and the humans and changing them into you know these things and making them different and mutating them oh my gosh bro what this was like <laughs> oscar isaac amazing actor natalie portman amazing actress Yo, this was amazing. This was a great experience. I like I I I experienced everything from like fear to like uh to uh to uh, uh to every emotion imaginable, bro. Like I I I was like genuinely like I don't know if y'all could see it and just my face and my reaction of like how I like just felt, but like I literally felt so like un like settled and just like there was so much going on. And the way that she, the old girl delivered that line of annihilation and when the thing was like forming itself. But it will grow until it encompasses everything. Our bodies and our minds will be fragmented into their smallest parts until not one part remains. Annihilation. Out of her and like mirroring her movements and following her up like y'all. And the way they told the story is something that I really love in these types of movies. How they kind of like tell it like backwards, not backwards necessarily, but like they show us something that is currently happening like first and then go back to you know what previously happened and them explain her explaining it. But like showing us showing us like what happened, the events instead of like her narrating it. Wow. bro, Wow. I just have so many questions. Where did it come from? Did it crash land? Why did it come here? What was its purpose? What did it, you know, intend to do? Um, what happened with the end with her husband and you know Cain? Like obviously that wasn't her real husband because her husband, you know, killed himself and that thing took his identity and you know his his appearance and came to find Lynn, Lena. I don't know if I said Lynn, Lena. Wow, this was I don't know what I was expecting from this, but I was not expecting any of this. This was like 10 times better than what I expected. Not that I had my expectations low, but yo, and there was so many, like not so many, but like in the beginning, how like I started with her, like kind of like teaching like her class or whatever. Like it kind of reminded me of uh, Arrival, another movie that was also recommended uh, to me, but I had already watched that before. Uh, just how it started off with, you know, her teaching. It started off that same way with uh, uh, Amy Adams in Arrival and then, you know, the aliens appearing and then her kind of like doing more research on that, being sent there to, you know, do that. Like it kind of gave me that same vibe. So I can definitely see why, you know, th these two movies were, uh, recommended to me like in the same you know like uh, recommendation because like these movies are similar and not to compare because i love arrival one of my favorite movies ever and i love amy adams she's one of my favorite actresses but this movie was actually one of my favorites that i've seen that i've watched on this channel like i actually thoroughly enjoyed this this was amazing i don't know what more to say because there was just so much going on and it's like i feel like like it was all said in my reaction so it's like yo Yo, y'all gotta, y'all gotta give this a like, man. I, oh my gosh, there was so many moments throughout this movie that just had me, oh, just a crazy amount of mixed emotions and just unsettling like images that we saw and just ooh, graphic things like with the tentacle. I still don't know what, what what's up with that. His, like if they were imagining that or if we actually saw that, but we actually saw that because I was on the camcorder, the tentacles inside of his body and how he would just spread out and open on the wall when they discovered him in the little uh warehouse area that they were in and then with the bear how it was like mimicking and echoing you know the voices of the the people that it consumed this is this is this was a great concept for a movie yeah this is definitely one of those movies where it's like the audience can kind of like take their own interpretation of like what this movie is and what it's supposed to be and kind of just like grasp from different you know aspects of the film and really just like create their own idea of what the hell was going on explanations as to what the hell it is and just kind of really go on for like hours and talking about what the hell you think was going on and what happened and what the creature is and who's who and you know it's like this is, this is really crazy like it really got you like thinking like 
this is definitely one of those movies that's going to be lingering in the back of my mind just for for a couple of weeks. <laughs> so I for real want to know y'all's thoughts and how y'all interpreted you know this you know thing and you know this this movie overall and you know y'all's thoughts on this because bro this 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 is this is fire and I love movies that do stuff like this where the audience can you know create their own ideas of what you know is going on and what it is and you know not necessarily having you know uh one true ending and explanation you know for it so because like it's still like i feel like that's like the main point though it's like something like this can be super scary because of you know like you know it's like people say don't be scared of the unknown but this is like a like a, a good example of like no you should be scared of the unknown not like i don't want to say be scared of the unknown but like a, in a situation like this where it's something as big and as you know like uh uh, uh scary and intimidating as as something like an alien creature or whatever it is attacking like you, it, you should be scared of it. and it's like it's it's so unknown you don't know anything about it they never even found out anything about it besides kind of what was already happening to them but by the time they realized all that it was too late so it's like oh my gosh <laughs> all i can do is clap it up all i can do is clap it up i i I'm, I'm speechless. I feel like I said everything I needed to say. Yo, <laughs> y'all gotta let me know what y'all got out of this movie and like, like how y'all interpreted, you know, the 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 antagonist, I guess you could say, of this movie and like what what you like think its purpose was or what it was really doing with whatever it was doing. I don't know. Like, I'm just so lost right now. I'm just there's so many things running through my mind right now. Oh my gosh, I'm just. <laughs> thank you for recommending me this for real thank you because this was actually truly really good maybe i could do like a video where like i uh i put, post on my patreon uh for free i'll post like a video of like me like watching i don't know like a breakdown of this or something and talking about it more in depth or something because this was actually really good i feel like there's a lot to unpack but at the same time not a lot because like i said before it's, it's so unknown and there's so many things that we don't know about it and that the characters within the movie didn't even know about it because there's not anything to really learn about it <laughs> i appreciate y'all for watching though please give this video a like i'd very much appreciate it and if you want to see this full length reaction i will be posting this on my patreon i ended the recording but then i realized while well, i was just thinking about the movie reflecting on it and what was happening i don't know what the significance behind like you know the water would be like the cup of water the glass of water but like we kept seeing that a lot throughout the movie you know in the beginning uh you know when she gave the glass of water to her husband her husband you know when uh he had came back to the house um when they were holding hands together and it was reflecting on them uh when uh I, when they were interrogating her in the room and there was a cup of water glass next to her i don't know we just kept seeing it throughout i don't know if like what that's really supposed to represent or or what but if y'all know let me know but i just want to point that out i noticed that yeah that's gonna do it all for this reaction see y'all in my next video peace yo what <laughs> what no, no no that was truly a magnificent film magnificent that's the only way to describe that movie magnificent magnificent man